Hello, my name is Natasha and welcome to my YouTube channel. This one is about colours, how to um, keep them lasting longer because they do fade. I've recently had my blues, purples, blues, purples and red, even reds put in. I found out that the reds fade the fastest and the blues last the longest. So these are my tips on how to keep the colours longer by past experience. Um, the, the reds was new, obviously it was brighter. The reds are start off with a brighter colour. And the uh, blue is a, like, not so bright colour, but it lasts longer. It's so interesting. So here are my tips. When you have the colours put in, try and go as long as possible without washing your hair. Um, I know it's hard if you're into workouts, running, step and all that, but plait your hair or don't wash it or just have a few rest days to chill out and be lazy. Um, the, se uh, the second tip is to perhaps, if you love your training, perhaps go four or five days solid training and washing your hair. And then perhaps have a two or three days without washing your hair and then get the plaques put in. But wash your day before you have the plaques put in. Because this time round, if I had the plaques put in, they're actually a lot brighter than the first time I had the plaques in. Another tip is this one. This is brilliant. It's really good for... Um, protection your hair from split ends and damage and making it super silky soft but it does fade your hair and actually does fade your hair so i would put this on on the run-up to having it redone when it's stayed it well how the run-up to having the roots blue having the roots blues and purples topped up but uh, the la two or three washes before you actually go to the salon i'd use normal conditioner just to make sure they come out nice and bright another tip this conditioner does not fade your hair at all. It will not fade it. It will not fade it. So always put it on after washing your hair. It's easy as a brush because bleached hair can get naughty and this one actually can actually sort of help and it leaves it silky. And it actually is very good cream and it leaves it really silky as you can feel sort of on the sort of like end of my ponytail. Another tip is to try and keep the plaits in as long as possible. So if you're training, try and avoid going out in the rain because that will mess your plaits up. So perhaps um, if it's very into step aerobics or do aerobics in your home or go to the gym, whatever you feel comfortable with. I tend to do aerobics and step at home. I used to go to the gym, but I lost my confidence in the gym. Um, I do outdoor running, but obviously not in the rain with these in because I, I don't want to get them um, messed up. And um, so well, after a few days, where they joined up obviously got obviously they're really strong type there and there but you might get a bit baggy around there after a few days so just put it in a ponytail bunch it up and then and do the big plait keep the little plait in and have it in a ponytail it'll last a lot longer honestly the plaits will definitely definitely last longer i hope this helped please subscribe natasha bowen on how to keep your colors lasting longer